we'll create the spring boot application with star.spring.io this is the address this is a spring initializer project it make it very easy and automatically select the correct version which are compatible with your settings of the dependencies as well as the spring boot version so this was going to be a main project uh, java is the programming language this is the version of the spring boot and here we have to define the group which is com.ptv.livebox so we are here simulating we are creating an, a, a service which is similar to netflix and uh, this, this is the group id so com.ptv is the company for which we are creating this livebox is the project name so that's how usually we group or create the package names um, so the, uh, the artifact name would be ptv movies service so we'll keep this group uh, id same but we will uh, change the artifact id like movie service review service payment service uh, feedback service chat all those services so the artifact will keep changing but the group name will remain same so we are publishing all the microservices against this group id so ptv movies service uh, just by the way uh, we are not doing this for ptv uh, this is just a sample for the sample we have selected uh, ptv we are not doing it for them uh, and it's not connected with ptv in any way okay now let's add dependency uh, dependency we will add web because this is going to be a web service that's why we added the web if you want to add more you can here so let's download this the project is downloaded and extracted i will open it in intellij but you can use uh, enterprise version because it enterprise version got lots of uh, other functionalities as well okay the project is loaded so this is pretty much a simple project nothing special main folder for our main code test is for all sort of testing and the pom file in the pom file we can see all these configuration are the one we specified in the web and uh, this is the web dependency that we added and the test dependency is added automatically here okay so let's go to the main class here so this is the startup application there is only one file here only one which is ptv movie service application and currently it does nothing so let's convert into a rest controller usually we create separate rest controller but for sake of uh, creating uh, this session we will use it so i am going to use get mapping here with health so this is the url so public word so this is the method we have created health it will just return okay let's run this in order to run the main method we'll click here application has been started let's try to access 8080 health and hooray we got our response so that's how we created our first microservice or how we created our first spring boot application thank you bye